October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Now, the disease doesn't just affect women. Men are also at risk. News 12 New Jersey's Jim Murdoch spoke with a man who is a breast cancer survivor to help raise awareness and spot the early symptoms of the potentially fatal disease. I never believed that men could have breast cancer. For AJ Violi, that false sense of security collapsed eight years ago. We were at a beach and my daughter noticed, you know, something uh, was not right in my right breast. Days later, AJ's personal doctor diagnosed him with stage three male breast cancer. A short time later, he came under the care of Dr. Serena Wong, a medical oncologist and breast cancer specialist at Memorial Sloan Kettering in Middletown. I do think that unfortunately there is a little bit of a stigma that somehow having breast cancer is not masculine. But it is rare. Dr. Wong says on average one in eight women will be diagnosed with breast cancer, but that number drops to one in 720 men. Because of the rarity of breast cancer in men, unfortunately there is a lack of awareness. According to Dr. Wong, male breast cancer risk factors include family history of cancer, chronic liver disease, obesity, heavy alcohol use, and Klinefelter syndrome. In the left lower lung, there is this nodule here, and this is what we had picked up on a scan. In AJ's case, his cancer was treated and removed, but leftover minuscule cancer particles showed up as a spot on his lung in 2023. He remains in good health and good spirits. By having AJ talk openly and honestly about that, hopefully that will encourage more men to feel more comfortable to have a discussion about breast health. Don't hesitate. If you see something, this is it. see something, say something. In Middletown, Jim Murdoch News 12, New Jersey. And Dr. Wan says early signs of male breast cancer include a lump or dimple in the breast and a lump or pain in the armpit. She says if you notice these symptoms, see your primary doctor immediately.